post-operative caring after circumcision surgery. With the improvement of people's health awareness and the pursuit of high-quality life, circumcision is gradually accepted by the public. A successful circumcision surgery, in addition to the operation process, post-operative care is also crucial. So, what should we pay attention to in post-operative care? Stay in hospital for observation within 30 minutes after the operation. Pay attention to whether there is bleeding in the incision and inform the doctor in time if there is bleeding. After the operation, the patients were treated according to the doctor's advices. It is suggested to use double-layer elastic bandage for pressure dressing and remove the outer elastic bandage and keep the inner bandage after two hours. After the anesthetic effect, there will be slight pain in the incision, which is a normal phenomenon, no need to worry. Loose pants should be worn after the operation to prevent pressure on the wood. The disposable paper cup can be used as a protective cover to reduce the contact friction between the external genitals and the clothes. The patients can also wear the post-operative care pants to protect the wood. Severe activities should be avoided within three days after operation to prevent the bleeding or loose bandage. It is suggested that sex should be forbidden within 30 days in adults. Follow the doctor's advice to remove the bandage after operation. If there is bleeding in the wound and the dressing is contaminated, the patient should go to the hospital to change the dress in time. If there is no special case, remove all bandages 48 hours after the operation and wipe the wound with iodine for disinfection 3 to 5 times a day to prevent infection. Shower is allowed 72 hours after operation. Wrap the wound with plastic film to prevent the wound from being wet. Keep the wound dry and disinfect with iodine. Sutering stables will fall off automatically after operation. Three days after operation, patients can apply the moisture burn ointment on the wound. Once in the morning and once in the evening. Or gently rub the staples one week after the operation to accelerate the healing and staple removal. Generally, the sutering staples start to fall off in 7 to 10 days and finish in about 30 days. Due to the difference of individual constitution, a few patients can return to the hospital to remove the stables if they do not remove completely within 30 days after operation. Patients with prepuce adhesion, common in patients with phimosis and children. After operation, there may be yellow liquid excavation and scab in glands. This is normal. Patients do not need to worry. M scab will fall off. It is recommended to apply erythromycin eye cream on scab to prevent infection. Patients should eat light food, avoid alcohol, seafood, and spicy food after operation. In case of continuous bleeding, dysuria, and severe adiva and peanuts after operation, the doctor should be contacted in time. Careful care, quick recovery.